Hey guys, Zangus, and today I'm going to give you an unboxing of the LG 4K 49UF 69 TV. So this is a brand new 49 inch smart UHD TV and it will be specifically designed to use the smart apps and also provide incredible picture quality with up to 4 times the resolution of standard 1080p. So of course if you've unboxed the TV before then you'll note there is an awful lot of packaging and also a lot of protecting to ensure that the TV stays secure. So the first thing we have when we actually open the product is actually the two stands. Now LG have actually wanted to go for a quite sleek design, so what they've actually done is gone for actually quite small stands, but of course this should be specifically designed to keep the TV stable. Next we just have some regular power cables, and now let's try and actually get the main packaging off to actually reveal the rest of the product. So once we've got rid of the final packaging and also all of the rest of the polystyrene, then we can actually set up the TV and actually start it. So now that we've got all these smart TVs with quite an advanced OS, it is quite basic compared to a regular OS, say Windows or Mac OS, but the OS that they've actually installed on TVs are becoming a lot smarter, so we have a lot more apps and a lot more functionality. One product a lot of companies have actually adapted is giving the wireless remote the ability to actually use it as if it's a Wii remote and it's quite interesting because it actually means that you come with two separate remotes and I've found that loads and loads of different models are actually trying to manufacture this simply because of the simplicity but also because of the functionality as well. So the setup guide is fairly simple, giving you pretty basic instructions and of course it will give you other things like setting up the Wi-Fi and of course getting used to the actual GUI. So the main GUI for the home screen is actually really nice, it really takes advantage of the full display and makes it incredibly easy to use, and of course what's most important I think is that it actually makes it suitable for the wireless remote. So this is actually the magic remote, and that's what LG call it, it's taken the advantage of the technologies that have been used in the Wii U remote and actually integrated it into their own remote. So after watching back some 4K content, I have to say that the 4K TV is absolutely stunning, it's got absolutely immense detail, and it's incredibly sharp. Now while the high definition is absolutely fantastic and it's going to be really great for watching 4K Blu-ray discs, the main problem is that there is just such little content out there at the moment that's available in 4K. Of course things like Netflix are actually uploading and enabling a lot of their content to be streamed in 4K, but at the moment there just really is just not enough. Of course over the years this is going to improve, but for the meanwhile there just isn't enough content. I definitely do think that 4K is the way forward in terms of resolution, but a lot of companies are trying to cram 4K into their products. For example, Sony have crammed a 4K screen into their new Xperia Premium smartphone, and I think that is just unnecessary. Of course, with TVs, it's just going to make it a lot more pleasurable, and it's going to make it a lot more detailed, and for all content, it's going to be much, much sharper. But for the meanwhile, even recording devices like cameras haven't even caught up with 4K. So just the fact that there isn't even enough content that has even been made in 4K in the first place makes the TV a little bit limited. Anyway, there is my unboxing of the LG 49-inch 4K TV. If you did enjoy it, then definitely be sure to give this video a thumbs up, and thank you for watching. And of course they do offer their own versions of the bigger lenses, but they are a lot more expensive and Tamron are actually a budget brand that provides you really good lenses for a lot less than the standard ones provided by both Nikon and Canon. So we do have a lot of instructions and of course this is an international product so there are going to be a lot of manuals. And straight out the box, there's not really that many accessories. All we actually really want is just the lens. And it does actually come with a really big lens cap and also a really big lens cover as well. It's quite a nice addition because not only can it be used for actually protecting the actual lens when you're not using it, but it can also be...